All right, virtual machine workstation with uh, running on Windows 7 Pro, and we're gonna try launching Backtrack 4. It's a Linux distribution um, with some kind of. Uh, it's really nice for uh, security stuff. So, okay, and we'll get more into that later in another video. But uh, let's try this. This is the first time I've worked with VMware workstation. I usually I usually use server version, but. I decided to try this one and it's this little icon down here I'm just gonna open the workstation see what happens uh, okay a little tip let's see we want to create a new virtual machine I already have the ISO downloaded it's just sitting on my desktop for now well, let's try typical we want to install it from the ISO file and it's just there it is cannot do that with operating system and Okay, it's gonna be Linux. Uh, I doubt it's in here, so let's just try. Um, it's definitely a 32 bit. I'm not sure the kernel, probably the latest. Let's try that, see what happens. Uh, virtual machine name, let's do backtrack for uh, pre release. We'll just do pre. <coughs> Location is gonna store it in my documents. Um, specify the disk capacity. Let's run it with 8 gigs. That's fine. Um, store virtual disk in a Steam file. Yeah, that's fine. Next. Power on this virtual machine after creation. Sure. Let's see what happens. Um, oh, we got to pop a serial number in there. And uh, let me pause it first. Okay, I just punched in the serial. I don't want to register. Let's just see if this thing will power on. <clears throat> okay. Backtrack, devices, options, power on this virtual machine. Okay, let's see what happens. I don't I don't think the networking is gonna work completely. Let's see the following devices can be connected to the virtual machine using the status bar, choosing VM, USB composite device. Okay. There's our backtrack. Uh, menu. We're just gonna kick off the uh, the boot. <clears throat> I can't recall exactly what key it was to get my mouse out of there. I thought it was Alt or Control or oh, there it is, Control Alt or Alt Control. So it's booting up for the first time, and I'll pause it until well, not I'll let it go. Kind of give you a real time look on how long it takes to boot this thing up. Okay, we're ready. So we're gonna we're already logged in as root. So we just want to start. Oops, let's click in there. Start X and close that down. And there we go. And we're using backtrack. And bada bing bada boom and there's all kinds of cool tools and utilities and things you can do in here um, let's see let's see let's open up a shell and go um, I have config I'm curious okay no it's not configured so I'll still have to set that up but uh, there you go it's uh, a Linux distri distribution called backtrack 4 running in virtual machine workstation on Windows 7 Pro.